So the MASH concept was born almost a decade ago in the fall of 2009. Started working on old projects that I had lying around. Two of them were uh, a Model A from 1931 and an old Harley Davidson bobber that I built while I was still in the service. And on a beautiful day, I decided I wanted to take one for a ride, but I couldn't choose which one I wanted to take. And I thought to myself, why should I have to choose? Why can't I have both? The initial rendering was nothing more than the front half of a Model A and the rear half of a Harley Davidson motorcycle pretty much welded together in the middle. So I hired somebody to start doing legitimate sketches and renderings of what would now become the Alpha model that you see today. From there, the chassis went from literally welding two different models together to a custom full tube chassis um, with a mid-engine mount behind the rear seat in front of the rear wheel and offered ample storage up front and the usability that you can't get from any other models that exist. In the Alpha, you can expect all of the standard safety features that you see in regular four-wheeled vehicles available today from airbags, seat belts, and in the convertible and roadster models, there will even be a reinforced retractable roll bar in case of a rollover. The fun of a motorcycle with the stability and control of a four-wheeled vehicle and the performance upgrades with acceleration and fuel efficiency in particular, um, the Alpha is estimated to get approximately 45 miles per gallon. The Alpha prides itself on its all-weather drivability and usage as an everyday vehicle. The Alpha offers fully enclosed cockpit with a roof, windshield wipers, air conditioning, heat, and every other feature you would expect. If you purchase an Alpha, you'll have access to one of the largest dealer networks in the country that already exists for parts, upgrades, any performance modifications you want to make, and any issues you have mechanically with the vehicle, you won't have to send back to the manufacturer or find a custom mechanic to work on the vehicle. Another thing that sets the Alpha apart from its competitors is MASH's commitment to being 100% made in the USA. With that being said, one of our main focuses is job creation. We'll start with 12 employees and anticipate growing into the hundreds with a focus on those with a diverse background and technical skills and those transitioning out of the military. MASH has three major project milestones right now. The first is the completion of three prototypes, one of each model, the coupe, the convertible, and the roadster. Once that's complete, the second milestone is gonna to be to finish our office space and our headquarters here in Pennsylvania. So the third major milestone is gonna be breaking ground on our 20,000 square foot facility behind our existing building here in Pennsylvania. This will be our headquarters, our production line, and um, mass manufacturing of the Alphas will occur there, and any future models will also be designed and produced in that facility. The auto cycle is an untapped facet of the automotive industry that other manufacturers are steadily becoming a part of with new models and trying to compete with major manufacturers while still not offering everyday usability and the versatility that the Alpha has. Pennsylvania was actually the first state in the country to pass the auto cycle bill, and that's one of the reasons we're headquartered here. That bill basically made it available for any consumer with a regular driver's license to operate anything classified as an auto cycle. And we expect the remaining states will follow suit uh, in the next few years. When Florida revised their driving requirements to recognize the unique status of the auto cycle as something between a motorcycle and a passenger vehicle, the number of prospective buyers increased from just over 600,000 with a motorcycle endorsement to over 14.6 million with a regular operator's license. In May of 2019, Montana became the 46th state to pass this same legislative action, with the remaining four states working to follow suit. Being defined governmentally lends to greater acceptance by the consumer, and it won't be long before you see them in mass on our highways and back roads. MASH is going for a ride and you're gonna wanna come with us.